Okay guys, so I wanted to get started by um, showing you the products that I am going to be using. I got this small little paint tray. Um, where did I get this from? I think I got it from Walmart. It's just a small one. Um, I have five bottles of Mod Podge. I'm using the Gloss Luster one. Um, and then this is the glitter I'm going to add to it. Now I am going to be doing the Mod Podge glitter method versus putting the, the glitter inside of the paint because I already like the paint color that I have on my wall. So I don't want to change or alter the paint color. I just want to add like a shimmery diamond effect to it. Um, so I'm going to mix silver, this holographic silver, which I got from Michaels with, um, just some white glitter. The We Are Memory Keepers brand also from Michaels. So I'm going to start off by doing two bottles of Mod Podge and one full of this and one full glitter of white and see where that gets me. The uh, consistency, we want it to be kind of thick like pancake batter. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and mix that up and I will come back and show you what it looks like before I start to apply it to the wall. Okay guys, so here is the Mod Podge with the glitter in it. Um, I didn't use the whole bag yet so here's about how much I used from the silver and I used pretty much the same amount from the white and I just so far I've only used two Mod Podge and then half of well about a little bit more than a half of this and a little bit more than a half of that and here's where we are it is pretty thick um I'm kind of sorry if y'all can hear my kids in the background of my dog. They're playing tag, of course, while I'm trying to record. But um, it is pretty thick, and I wanted to be able to kind of spread evenly on the wall. So I'm not going to add any more glitter. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they are so loud. Um, so I'm not going to add any more. But I am just going to go ahead and start painting it on there. Um, basically, what I'm going to do is just take my brush and go in an upwards motion. And I'm going to go ahead and speed the video up a little bit while I'm doing this. And then I'll probably do a voiceover because my kids are absolutely being ridiculous right now. So, um, yeah, I'll show you how I paint it on the wall now. Okay guys, so as you can see here, I'm just taking my brush, I'm dipping it in the Mod Podge, and then I'm just kind of going in an upward motion. Um, you want to make sure you have a good enough product on your brush. Um, this beats having to do a lot of work on your second coat. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to apply it as evenly as possible in an upward motion um, without making <laughs> too much of a mess. Okay guys, so it has been, it's actually been a couple days because I got a little busy so I still haven't been able to finish this wall. But here is the progress. I did that first coat where you basically just saw me taking my brush and going in the upward motion. Um, and this is how it's looking so far. It's definitely kind of patchy a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and give it another coat. Um, I got to get around the edges. Um, and then I have to clean up that part here and I didn't do the whole top part because I need a ladder. Um, but what I'm going to do now is like where it's kind of, if you can see where it's like patchy right there, um, I'm just going to go ahead and give it a second coat so that it does not look patchy like that. I want it to look, you know, even and clean. So we're going to go ahead and do a second coat. Okay, guys. So I did go ahead and apply the second coat. Um, as you can see here, I'm kind of just walking up on the wall so you can see it. 
um the holographic glitter on here i think looks so so pretty um the second coat definitely did really really well it looks way more even um and then you know i went, went around the edges now this little unit here i'm waiting for my dresser to be delivered so that i can take this out and do the rest of this wall so for now i just have this part of my wall done and then I added, you know, like a little table, a candle, my content planner. I have my chair in my rug. Um, and then, you know, I got this mirror. And, you know, I added some little lights around it. I think it's really pretty, really cute. And it goes good with my um, glamour wall. My glam wall, my little glam glitter wall so this is the final pro well it's not final final because like i said i still need to get my dresser delivered um but this is how it turned out and i will go ahead let me zoom back in on the wall so you can see the glitter do you see how cute that is that is so cute i think it came out really really cute it's just it's you know it's not too I mean, when you're standing, the camera doesn't, when I back up, the camera really doesn't do it justice. Like, when I'm standing here and I'm looking at it, I can see that it's glittery, it's shimmery, it's not too, like, overbearing. Um, so, yeah, the camera's not really picking up the glitter effect, but that is how it looks, the holographic. So, I really do like how it turned out. I need to get some little art pieces to put up, and hopefully I can finish the whole room sometime soon but yeah that is the progress that we made so far I probably could have done a second coat up here at the top to be honest but it's okay I'm not gonna really worry about it but yeah I just kind of want to show you guys how I did this glitter wall if you have any questions comments concerns drop them down below thank you guys so much for watching bye